What is going on guys? I'm on the back at you guys with another video. Been crazy long since my last video. Um definitely haven't stopped collecting. Just uh just haven't had time to make a video. And uh well, I got a bunch of stuff to show you guys. Probably won't get to the cards, the the singles for a while. I'll probably wait for a couple videos. It's gonna take more than one video for sure to show you guys. I just counted some of them and I easily have almost a hundred cards that I've been kind of collecting. Just a bunch of stuff I've been getting on eBay and just things like that. Um, I got a bunch of like these boxes you see in the background right here. Uh, the momentum I actually busted this. I actually busted this a while back. Same thing with the the Phoenix, the Classic. Um, of course, me and the uh, what do you call it? Uh, Stars and Stripes I busted that a while back. Um, and I got a little box of the little blaster of the playbook. Um, busted these a while back. Um, and the reason I got them in the background, because I will be showing you guys basically a little recap of what I got. I'm not going to be doing that today. Today, what I'm going to be showing you guys is a PSA submission I had a while back. Um, finally got that back. And then I actually have another submission that's out that I should be getting within the next week or so. I'll be showing you guys that very soon. Um, but, uh, so like I said, I'm showing you PSA today and... Right after that, I will be showing you a box break of this. Um, I was finally able to uh, not, what do you call it, uh, conquer the temptation of breaking this before I got it on video. So, still sealed box. I'm going to break this for you guys today, 2018 Chronicles. And hopefully we get something something crazy out of there. Um, let me never know. I was going to buy a box of Heritage. The released, what is it, yesterday? Two days ago, whatever it was. But, um, I don't know. There's a lot of risk, you know, low reward sometimes. And, uh, I've been kind of wanting to break one of these Chronicles. So I said, screw it. Why not? But, uh, yeah, guys, without further ado, let's show you what I got for PSA. Uh, I can't remember. I think it's like 17 or 18 cards submission. And a couple of these are my buddies, my buddy Steve's. And I'll show you guys what he got. Card number one. A beautiful right here. Gary Sanchez Inception. Number to 50, and he got an 8 on that, which is not horrible. I mean, as you guys know, these uh, these really thick cards right here, they're kind of hard to grade. And uh, honestly, I don't think an 8 too bad for that. Obviously, would have preferred 9 or 10, but not horrible. So that's card number 1 right there. Uh, card number 2, also my buddies. Actually, you know what? I'm going to show you my other card. I'm going to show you the, we'll get the 8s out of the way real quick. Um, this right here, it's a Peyton Manning, Presses Metal Gems, I believe it's the Teal, and that one also, like I said, got an 8, and that's from, uh, 2014 Flare Showcase, Flare Showcase, sorry, and a beautiful card, love this card right here, unfortunately got an 8, but, right there, sorry for the glare, 36 of 100, so beautiful card, but, yeah, like I said, got an 8, so, I mean, I'm not, not too bummed out about it, but kind of wish it would have been a little higher grade. But still a beautiful card and have encased. Um, let's see, card number three. Like I said, this is my buddies right here. And he, what he got graded was, I'll go this way, right there. No, Duque Hernandez, number 34 to 50 from Top Supreme. And this one here. Got a nine, so pretty sure he's pretty happy about that one. So that's pretty awesome right there. Beautiful autograph on those cards. And these are actually really nice cards. Same thing as the other one. I mean, the thicker cards are a little harder to grade. But pretty happy with the nine. That's pretty awesome right there. And I believe the rest of these are all going to be mine. Yeah, the rest of these are all going to be mine. And they're all going to be a bunch of Cubs. Obviously a bunch of Cubs. But before that, I did have one of these, and I sent in to get graded. Star Rookies from Upper Deck. St uh, Stephen Curry. Pretty sweet right there. And I got a 9 on that. Not too uh, disappointed, to be honest with you. I was hoping it didn't get an 8. So a 9 is definitely awesome for me right there. Had this in a, in a box. Didn't realize I even had it till I went through my card, so... Like I said, a nine is definitely a plus for me. 
So very nice card right there. I uh, believe the rest are baseball. Yep. And uh, pulled this out of uh, Father's Day pack right here. I don't know if you guys. I think I think I might have shown you guys. If not, actually I don't think I did show you guys. But I pulled a Shohei Otani rookie, numbered three seventy nine out of three ninety nine. Beautiful card right there. Got a nine. So not too bad right there. I think a lot of these cards, to be honest with you guys, you guys might have not seen a whole bunch of these cards. I've been out of uh, doing videos for a while now that uh, I kind of forget what I've showed you guys and what I haven't. So I'm going to assume you guys haven't seen any of these. We'll just go with that. Um, next one right here. It's a beautiful, finest, top's finest, Wilson Contreras. Oh, excuse me, guys. Give me one second. My boy needs something. Ah, sorry about that, guys. I'm back. Um, like I was saying, a beautiful right here, top's finest, Wilson Contreras. This is the old school uh, basketball insert. Beautiful autograph on that. Just love the way he signs. Um, I thought for sure this was gonna be a little better than I, than what I got, but I got a nine out of it. Uh, still not upset. Um, beautiful card. Just the fact that I got it in case. Amazing card right there. Like I said, I'm going to assume most of these cards you guys haven't seen, if not all of them. But uh, there's another card that I know for sure you guys haven't seen. Um, one of the Cubs. The Cubs uh, number one draft pick this year. Or for uh, last year, whatever. Nico Horner. Number nine out of 99. Three contenders. Prospect ticket. Beautiful card right there. Can't complain. Can't complain on the grade. Unfortunately, I wanted a 10, but I did get a 9 on it. I mean, obviously, you go on 10s on all your cards, but I can't complain getting a 9. But beautiful, beautiful card. I've been really uh, starting to collect a lot of, uh, as you guys know, I collect the Pro Cubs prospects as soon as they come out. And uh, I've definitely done that. You guys will see in my next couple videos how much uh, I've actually collected lately. And the majority of it is Cubs, Bowman Chrome, and just different autos like that. Uh, next card right here. Another one of uh, Cubs' top prospects right now. Aramis Aidman, shortstop. 31 out of 99. This is, uh Peaks of Potential. I think, that's, or I think that's what it's called. Yeah, Peaks of Potential. And as you guys see right there, it got a 9 on it. Um... I think this one I do know what why it got a nine. I think it had a little bit of surface scratching on it. So I mean I I'm I'm good with a nine on this one. Beautiful card right there. So like I said, not not upset on that one. Um next one right here. Another one of uh I think this one was not last year but the year before. Cubs drafted him. Alex Lang. I think he might have been a second round pick. I can't remember right now, top of my head. But nice on card auto right there. Numbered 43 out of 99. Same thing, prospect tickets from contenders. And got a 9 as well on that. I guess there's different variations. This one's glove next to the face. So very nice on that one. Like I said, I'm not gonna complain getting nines. Um let's see here. Do these a little bit. Alright, next one right here. Another Cubs, obviously another Cub right here. You got Tarsha Brooks, number 139, 149, the, the refractor version, Bowman Chrome first. I uh, got a 10 on that. It's very nice right there. I actually seen him play spring training, and he's a scrappy little player. Definitely enjoy watching him play. So, uh, I think he's in AAA right now. Uh, let's see here. Next one right here. Brendan Little, 50 of 250, purple, Bowman Chrome, and uh, got a 10 on that one, so very nice right there. So, super pumped about that. <clears throat> Let me see another one right here. We got uh, Jose Alberto's, 26 of 99, the green refractor. Also got a 10 on that. 
So very excited to get these back in tens. Um, got a couple more of these that I want to grade. I think I have a couple of, like refractors and stuff. I like I said, I've been picking a lot of stuff up lately, and I do have uh, a lot of doubles and stuff of these. Got them cheap enough, so I said, you know what, screw it. Um, once again, uh, top prospect right here, Ramos Aidman. 326 or 362 of 499 the refractor Bowman first got a 10 on that as well very pumped on that a lot of these uh when I looked them over I mean I thought they were flawless too so I, I was I was kind of hoping for a 10 but you never know um let's see here once again Rama Sadman the purple 205 of 250 and got a 10 on that as well. So awesome right there. Let's see here. Next one right here. This one is numbered out of 75. So I was super pumped to get this one back. And that's uh, Dwayne Underwood. One of the Cubs uh, top 20 prospects in their, in their farm system. And that one came back at 10. The Green Refractor. And like I said, that one's numbered of 75. So... Awesome return right there. Uh, two more cards for you guys. Uh, this next one right here. It's a black refractor. I don't know if you guys have ever seen me. Um, I think I, I think you guys actually might have seen when I got this card in. This one right here, Jake's the net. Like I said, black. Got a ten on that. Freaking excited to get a ten on this one. If he ever pans out, this card could be huge. Uh, 30 of 35 so awesome right there and last but not least um pull this out of um alan and ginger myself i'm pretty sure you guys did see that video out of 2017 and that is ian hap there we go got a 10 on that so awesome right there especially something you pull out of out of a box yourself Super awesome right there. So there you guys have it. That's what I got for you guys today on the on the PSA submissions. Um, I will have um, another submission coming very soon. Like I said, within about a week. Um, so stay tuned for that. But uh, up next, I will be busting this right now for you guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Um, like I said, it's been a while. And... Uh, Hopefully I'll be making videos more often because I got way too big of a stack to show you guys and I shouldn't get that crazy with, with the cards like that. But I will be showing you guys uh, very soon what I got there. So you guys have a good one. I'll get back with you guys in a bit. Take care, guys.